Hi guys, this is day seven of the demos I'm doing from my latest sketchbook, Addictive. It's an artist sketchbook and it's the latest book I have out there. Um, it's a 276 page sketchbook. Look, you see this and you never remain the same when it comes to your sketches. Look, I'm telling you, every page is filled. Look at every single page is filled from the beginning to the end. Every single page is filled with sketches. No, look, <laughs> I'm just showing you a bit there. Okay, so here we today we're gonna go to page 139. And I'm gonna do a sketch with this is I think this is the first time I'm combining these ones. Um I've got two um pens here. It's the Tombow. 9942 and N75. I think I have used the N75, but I don't think I've combined it with the 942. And that's what I used for this sketch here. I'm gonna bring it closer. So it makes it show that this is the one. It's this man um, wearing a hat and I gave him an addictive sketch a hat. I don't think there was addictive was written there, but just to, to let you know, this is what we're using for our demo. So here we go, without wasting time, let's go straight into it. So the first thing I'll be looking at when I wanna sketch something like this is I'm gonna try and get the shape what covers his head. So that's a curve, it's a nice curve, very good. So that separates the, the hat from the face. So here I go. So that's the, and very lightly, you're gonna see these very light lines now, very light lines. I just wanna capture the whole essence. So that's the hat area over there. And this just creates a nice feel for his face. So I'm, look at me trying to already get the feel of the eyes there. And then here will be the nose. And then, you know, just carefully, I'm already trying to get his eyebrows in. You know, that one tips around there. And then the side of his eye. So very quick, I'm using a lot of organic lines here because this looks like a little bit of a more complicated face. So you can see me just finding my way. Anytime I'm not sure of it, I just use the organic line. So you see me just carving my way, carving my way through very lightly on his face until I'm very sure. So always sketch lightly, I would say. This is the side of that hat and this is another side of that hat. And then this, you know, I bring that down and I think I'm definite on there, so I'm just gonna go down. Um, and then a again, a lighter line and under his eyes, you notice they are dark. So I just leave those ones dark and under there, I leave that. So you can see the essence of the sketch is almost already there. Now, I love men with beards because they're the easiest because there's no, nothing more. It covers a lot of details, the chin and all that. So just leave that and then go for that beard, lovely. This is where you can use organic lines. Just really let the lines flow organically. No, no real um, seriousness to that. Just capture, I think, the. The, the curve of that nose is so important. I'll bring that down. And then from the side of his face over here, he's was, he was wearing a, a, a headphone. So just capture that in there and then continue with the beard line or underneath and then put that in there. Okay, so this all continued right down like that. I was seeing the strokes I used, trying to replicate this, you know, very quickly. This one I did in 2017, it was one week, 100 people in a week, and this was number 33. Um, I think this was from Liz Steele. She does this 100 people in, in, in one week every year. So I followed her on that. Now let's go onto the hat. Um, just get that angle right, you know, that little angle there. And then the hat just very nicely, just make sure we get the right angles. Everything is that is about, I can say it like angles is the most used of all. I wanna connect things in an angular way. I wanna make sure I get the right tilts because that's all it is. If you can get the right tilts, everything will work. See me pulling these lines out to get the move of the hat. And I'm just gonna put that addictive sketcher thing as if you know I've got a brand hat out there so people already know you're an addictive sketcher. If they see you sketching, they're not gonna really be annoyed because look, you know it's addictive and you know you're the addictive sketcher. Yeah, I wanna get as many people addicted to sketching because I know it will improve your painting. I know it will improve your drawing. This is just my philosophy and I believe so much in it. Now. Overall, I've been able to get very quickly the whole feel of his face. Now let's use the um, the the 942 Tombow. 
just to give this kind of a flesh tone to his face, right? Very quickly, I love these tombos, you know, um, they're brilliant stuff. So very quickly, you notice, just done that. And now I'm gonna use the tombow for his hat, just to add some tone in some areas. Um, you know, just the top of the hat there. And mostly around his beard, like just really a, a lot there. And then, oh, it's very dark. So I added more pressure when I did that, just to make it a little bit darker. And then around the beard, you know, just quickly, da -da -da -da, really nice. Around the beard here, really quick, 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 quick. And I stop. Now I'm gonna add some hatching. This hatching is so cool because I think it's the one thing that defines most of the work I do is the hatching. So I'm gonna carefully form the hatching for the nose. Look at the lines. So briefly, just bring those lines out. Let them live, let the lines live. And these strokes that come out here for the eye, just put those ones in. Um, a little bit here just to show movement. Um, by the side here, just, I want you to see how simple, simple this whole thing can be. Again, I'm just gonna quickly put in they make this a little bit dark so that it shows a difference and then make this one darker um, and then the lines of his beard I hope you can see how this is coming out and in, in such a, um, a short space of time we're able to to get this all right um, I think I made a mistake there just bear with me I think I was looking more at the camera but you know it's for you to capture it's for you to understand the whole process and you can sketch along with me as I'm doing this and, and, and see how it can build your confidence, you know? Okay, so here we go. I've got that down um, and here we go. Under here, it's a heavy line. So I'm just gonna make that heavier. You can't compare it to that line because you know, this one, it contains a little bit of tone. And now what I'm gonna do, which is not in the drawing, is add a little bit of a, a tone here so it shows that the hat is over it, just like that, boom. And voila, we have got, Without mincing words again, boom. We've got, um, okay, let me just put the final bits here. Just over here, one there, um, enhance that. Keep that, um, keep that a bit of an air, the eye there. But I think this is the way I would have gone about it. So this is day <laughs> day seven. Um, remember, this, this, these sketches are being done every day just to show you how I went about some of the sketches in the book. And I hope you enjoy this one, all from the Addictive. Addictive, it's an artist sketchbook. And if you haven't got the Addictive Sketcher, make sure you get it because the techniques I share here are the ones I've used to do the sketches in this book. Thank you.